right, Friends star Matthew Perry, better known as Chandler from Friends. I remember Friends. My mother used to watch it, so I know exactly who this is. But unfortunately, he has died at 54 years old after apparently drowning inside of his pool. All right, so I'm going to give you a little bit of information how they found him. I'm going to play the audio from the dispatch when the call was made. I'm going to show you, you know, about the drugs that they said they found in his residency and also what he had posted and when he had seen, you know, the last time he was seen publicly before his passing and even his post on social media. But let's just go ahead and read a little bit of this. But before I do, subscribe to my channel, No Branding Industry, the things about the entertainment industry you might not know, but I feel like you should. So I'm going to get y'all hip. All right. So let me go ahead and read. At 2.02 p.m. Pacific time, more details are surfacing about the circumstances surrounding Matthew Perry's death. As sources tell us, he actually died in his own house after some physical activity this morning. We're told Matthew came home sometime in the a.m. after a two-hour round of pickleball and that he sent his assistant out on an errand shortly thereafter. We're told when his assistant, re when his assistant returned about two hours later, he discovered Matthew unresponsive and called 911. Unclear if what Matthew was doing before his passing played any role in his death at this point. The investigation into his death is underway. So Matthew Perry, one of the friends stars. I'm sorry, I'm reading this out of order just because I already kind of know what they're going to say. But Matthew Perry, one of the stars of Friends, has died. TMZ has learned. Law enforcement sources tell us the actor was found Saturday at an L.A. home area where we're told he appeared to have drowned. Our sources say first responders rushed over on a call for cardiac arrest it is unclear what exactly on the grounds this happened so here's the dispatch audio right here So that's just them coming over the radio saying, you know, someone suffered from drowning and it was actually Matthew Perry, right? So it says, our sources say he was found in a jacuzzi at the home and we're told there were no drugs found at the scene. We're also told there are no foul play involved. So the drugs thing is not actually true necessarily. I'll get into that in a second, right? So let's just go here. So here it is right here. No illicit drugs, but prescriptions found at the home of drowning right so first responders who rushed to matthew perry's home saturday did not find any illegal drugs but new information from law enforcement services revealed there were numerous rx drugs found in the house our law enforcement sources tell tmz authorities found antidepressants anti-anxiety drugs and a copd drug in the house copd short for chronic obstructive pulmonary disease that drug is often used with people who have emphysema and chronic bronchitis matthew was a smoker during his life the la county coroner will conduct a toxicology exam to determine if any drugs were in perry's system but that could take months right so like i said unfortunately this guy right here he was in his pool and his, his assistant found him unresponsive in the, in the pool you know so let me just go ahead and go to the what they're saying a week prior to his death and his final Instagram post, right? So here he is right here. He's an old guy, 50, 54 years old. You know, not not extremely old, but he's old enough to, you know, walk around like this. And you know how people, when they get older, they really just stop caring how they look. Not saying he looks horrible here, but your man ain't really as clean cut as he used to be. But like I say, he's getting older. But here it goes right here. Matthew Perry, casual meal with a friend one week ago, plus eerie final IG post. So Matthew Perry seemed to be enjoying a day out with a friend exactly one week before, di before he died. Leaving a West L.A. eatery in a scene that turns out to be the last time he'd been seen in public. On October 21st, the friend star was walking out of an apple pan, a popular West L.A. spot for burgers, sandwiches, and pies. He appeared to be leaving with a male friend who was carrying a takeout bag. Matthew was growing a little goatee, a different look from the clean-cut guy millions of Friends fans knew and loved. But all in all, the guy seemed to be doing well. Prior to that, Matthew Perry was seen on October 3rd as he left the workout 
in Los Angeles. TMZ broke the story. Matthew's assistants found him unresponsive Saturday morning at his home just a couple hours after he completed a two-hour match of pickleball. Our source says he was found in a hot tub and there were no drugs found on the scene. Like I said, they found prescription drugs in there. But this is from his actual final Instagram post right here. This is his final Instagram post, which is on 1023. It certainly seems like Matthew enjoys soaking in the tub, but an airy image now. It's an airy image now, but just six days ago, in what in what would be his final Instagram post, he posted a nighttime shot from the hot tub and included a caption, Oh, so warm water swirling around makes you feel good. I am Matt Man. Clearly a sense of humor his fans love and came to expect from the beloved 54-year-old actor was still intact. So, like I said, unfortunately, he passed away. More information getting developed. But, you know, it's like a lot of celebrities are dying, you know, and California is no crazy. It's no stranger to, you know, celebrities dying. And speaking of that, here's a story about a supermodel that actually was killed and found inside of her refrigerator. You should go watch that video. But subscribe. Hit that subscribe bubble right here. And go watch this video right here. There's a lot of stuff going on in California. I'm out.